Hi, welcome to MMA Made Easy, where we break hard techniques into easy chunks. Today we're going to be looking at the transition from the stack guard to the full guard. Uh, now, what I'm going to be doing is, you'll notice Neil isn't quite all the way up. That's kind of all the way up. He's not quite here yet. Okay, he's in the process of stacking these stuff. Okay, so he's here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to reach up and I'm going to grab his head in a Muay Thai clinch. And I'm going to pull his head off to the side. What that does is it makes him, as he lifts me, uh, you want to do this just as your body goes about a millimeter off the ground, okay? You will fall, but only a little bit. Uh, from there, what you want to do is you want to move his head to the side, and that makes his neck support my entire weight uh, for a short period of time. It's not even his full neck, it's only uh, one muscle on the side. So as he lifts me, he goes back down into the, into the closed guard. I love this transition uh, because it allows my partner to exert so much energy uh, in, uh, to, to slam me or to lift me up or whatever it is why, why, why we're doing that. Um, and I'm holding on like a little spider monkey. <laughs> I'm just holding on like, no, I'm not going to let go. So they really think they're going to slam me, but they only get about a millimeter off the ground and then their entire neck just feels this uh, incredible pressure uh, and weight and all of a sudden they just fall and collapse and they've exerted so much energy for literally no result. It also sets you up for a tornado, uh, for a tornado sweep really nicely because they're really falling down into one side. So uh, check out that sweep as well.